Another day, another headline we don't want to read. Babysitter and husband arrested after child dies from physical and sexual abuse. It's hard to believe that a child can be raped or molested, and sometimes worse. And in most cases, their predators are set free. The abuse all involving a single foster home in Massachusetts and at least six children reported Kathy Kern and why is society pushing it aside as if it can wait and not that important? I honestly felt like I was gonna die. They're heartless individuals. It wasn't just beaten. He basically treated me like a slave. After you took a shower, you put on your towel and he didn't want you to wear underwear under it. Then he would check all the kids, but under their towel. Mm -hmm. Like, he wouldn't look under there, he'd just stick his hand up. I'm not going to call what we went through abuse. I call what we went through torture. He was a different kid. He was not the happy-go-lucky little boy that loved to play outside. He was totally different. He just wanted to lay on the couch. Just think of all the silent cries of so many children that can be heard. How can this happen? And why does it keep happening? child sexual abuse. It's all right to tell by Beulah Coates. Can you even imagine what they have to endure? Justice? What justice? And for whom? There has to be national and community attention before we have any hope of stomping out sexual abuse and abuse of any kind. Who is protecting the children? Better laws should be enforced. Where do we go from here? What course can we take? Something has to be done. You can help prevent child sexual abuse. Read this book and be influenced by its great cause. We, we can, can make, make it, it happen. happen. Protect, Protect so many children from ever going through this painful ordeal. Get a copy of Child Sexual Abuse, It's Alright to Tell by Beulah Coates. Message us for more details.